Hey Alex, how would your friends describe you? My friends would describe me as being very goofy, uh, lazy, loyal, honest. I like to be honest with my friends, sometimes a little too much, but I'm also very nice. So Alex, what are two pet peeves you have? Pet peeves is people who are late. I understand that sometimes there's accidents or, you know, something going on. I understand, but for people who are late all the time, it kind of bugs me a little bit. Only because my dad taught me to always be on time. That's the only way. And then my second pet peeve is... I have to think about this one. Huh. I don't know if I have a second pet peeve. It's not coming to mind. Um, oh! People who wear sneakers without socks. I don't understand that. How can you wear tennis shoes without socks? I just, it blows my mind, really. Hey Alex, what's the tallest building you've been to the top of? The tallest building I've been to the top is the Eiffel Tower in Paris. I went when I was a junior in high school. Very beautiful, especially at night. I recommend going. But, um, if you could live anywhere, where would it be? If I could live anywhere in the world, I'd probably live somewhere in Europe, or specifically Switzerland, because I really want to try their chocolate. Okay, and Autumn, do you like or dislike surprises? Why or why not? Yeah, I usually really like surprises, except I have a very bad habit of finding out the surprise before it actually happens. Um, what's the most unusual thing you've ever eaten? I'm not one to try very many new foods, but I have tried one of those lollipops that have the scorpion in the middle of it, but no, I did not eat the scorpion. Hey Brianna, if money was no object, what would you do all day? That's a good question. I think if money wasn't an object in my life, I'd probably spend all day like traveling and eating good food and I'd want to have kids and start like raising them as well as I could and just focus on like traveling and experiencing the most that I can around the world and like just eating and consuming good random food. You could hire someone to help you. Would it be with cooking, cleaning, or yard work? If I could hire someone to help me with something, it would definitely be yard work. Um, I don't mind cooking and cleaning, but when it comes to doing the yard work, let's just say that I've picked my weeds once and I hope to never do that again. Thank God I have a dad who's willing to do that for me. If you join any past or current music group, which would you join? Join a music group? I think it'd be fun to be a part of the Cheetah Girls, honestly. I think I would have so much fun just dressing up all crazy and singing on stage with my girlfriends and traveling around. That would just be probably the most ideal singing group that I could be a part of. Hey Dylan, what's the last thing you recorded on television? The last thing I recorded on my TV was The Office. Hey Dylan, what's your favorite part of your career? My favorite thing about being a student ambassador is helping students. Hey Dylan, is your glass half full or half empty? My glass is always half full because I see the good in everything. All right, Shayna, this question is for you. How many languages do you speak? So I only fluently speak one language and that is English. However, I do speak a little bit of Spanish and a little bit of French. Shayna, what was your favorite subject in school? My favorite subject in school was science because I loved all the experiments you could do and the dissections were pretty cool. Dana, do you love or do you hate roller coasters? I hate roller coasters. I do not like to go on them because I am terribly afraid of heights. So roller coasters are a no for me. What's the craziest thing that you've done in the name of love? The craziest thing I've done for love is probably going on a roller coaster because I'm terrified of them. Second question I'd like to ask would be, do you collect anything? If so, what is it? 
I collect DVDs because I'm obsessed with movies. What was the last movie you went to? What did you think about that movie? The last movie I saw was It 2. It was really good. Um, it was sad, but like really funny. So I liked it. What makes you angry? I don't get angry very easily, but I guess one thing that makes me angry is when uh, someone does a lot for other people or specifically a, a person and the, the other people don't really appreciate or take into consideration the sacrifices that they make. What would you sing at karaoke night? My go-to karaoke song? Uh, for a long time, I think it was just like Heaven by The Cure, but really, right now, it's any song on the first half of Plans by Death Cab for Cutie. On a scale of 1 to 10, how funny would you say you are? On a scale of 1 to 10, I would say I think I'm pretty funny. Um, I think other people think I'm funny, but I would give myself a 10 just because I make myself laugh all the time.